Hey everybody, it's Monday, September the 3rd, 2012, and you guys know what that means. Happy Arbor Day! It's, it's not Arbor Day, it's Labor Day. Well, I guess in that case, I'm going to do what everybody's supposed to do on Labor Day. I'd be productive on Labor Day when you could just play Super Smash Brothers all day. Fuck you, Bowser. This past week has been aggravating. Hurricane Isaac passed through New Orleans on Tuesday and pretty much hovered over the entire area, probably all the way until Thursday morning. It was just a really unpleasant experience, and I know some people are still without power. I saw an energy car yesterday, like, park next to a down power line, and all I could think was, why aren't you out of your truck and, like, picking up said power line? Isaac was a Category 1 Ian ceiling, like, caved in. I'll leave a link in the doobly-doo uh, of the pictures of Ian's room. For those people who are like, oh, Category 1s are nothing. They can actually do, you know, some pretty bad damage. As for my house, we didn't suffer any major damage from Isaac. We have a couple shingles off of my garage, as well as uh, we have a vent on the top of our garage, and there's a hole in the vent. That's essentially the extent of our damage. We didn't flood. We were without power until Thursday night, and uh, that was just not fun. But anyway, that's enough about hurricanes. Let's talk about school. I'm signed up for the Delgado Emergency Alert System, and I got a text this morning that said, hey, school's not even happening tomorrow. So a part of me is like, cool, dude, you get to sleep in for one more day. And another part of me is like, you're probably losing some holiday time. Yeah, you're definitely losing some holiday time. That's kind of a bummer. But let's talk about the first week of school. Now, Ian, like you said, I had the same problem with a new campus. I got lost a couple times. I definitely agree with you that whole like walking with the crowd and then having to turn around because you realize you're going the wrong way. You can't just like stop and be like, yeah, I'll just turn around. Doesn't work. I would like be like, oh, I have a text message. And then I would like lean up against the wall. Like I was cool. Like, yeah, dude, don't worry about me. Just go around and check on the text. And then I'd slightly walk to my class. As far as finding my classes goes, everything except one class is in the same building. Um, I just got, was it, I was in a Spanish class when I should have been in my math class. I didn't sit through the Spanish class. Uh, the teacher came in and she said, this is Spanish. And I was like, uh, no, we're not gonna be in math. And I had to like just run around right before class started and I got to math on time. I gotta be honest with you guys, not being in school for a week is just kind of uh, lame. Don't get me wrong, I like having a day off just as much as the next guy, but under these circumstances, I'd much rather be in class. I'm excited to go back. To everyone watching, I know what you're thinking, like, why aren't we posting daily videos yet? Why is it just kind of still spaced out? Well, Isaac, we can kind of forgive everybody. Um, I'm giving everybody this week kind of like a, just like prepare yourself week. If you don't post this week, cool, I'm not going to hold it against you. But by next week, if you're on this channel, you're dedicated to be on this channel, post a video next week. Please, that's all I'm asking. I'm trying to make a video! Stop yelling, I'm trying to be YouTube famous right now. I'm trying to be YouTube famous, and I'm trying to make my video for today, which is so loud. Alright. Anyway, I want to reiterate the rules. We are a daily video blog. First things first, you just gotta post. You have one day a week where you have to make a video. You can record it any time before you know, that day. You don't have to record it that day and just post it on your day. That's literally all you have to do. The second rule we have over here at Dorm Room TV is your video can't be over five minutes. And I know what you're thinking. Christian, your video is definitely over five minutes. There are a few exceptions to the rules. Update videos or like special occasion videos. Also educational videos can be as long as they need to be. This video, more so just an update video. If you fail to comply to these rules, well, there's punishments. Like, physical or, you know, eating challenges. It's punishment day. <laughs> oh! Oh! Ah! What have you done to me? Just, just bought the milk. I'm about to fucking explode. <laughs> <laughs> Mental challenges. <laughs> Or just anything we feel like making you do. I have to spend 10 hours here in Target. <laughs> Sorry. 
So if you don't want to be punished, just make your video. Our new channel member it might be here tomorrow, or she might be here next week. I don't, I don't know. She's coming soon, and when she does appear, please, please, please make her feel welcome. Watch all of her videos as you watch all of mine, and I hope you watch everyone else's. That's another thing. I know that some people only watch mine, or some people only watch, you know, me and Jesse's, or me and James's, or whoever. This is a group effort. This is a collaborative YouTube channel where we're all friends here. And I feel like if you're subscribed to this channel, you shouldn't just subscribe to us because Will is on the channel or Ian's on the channel. You should subscribe and watch us. I mean, we, we go through the trouble of making a video every day. And I feel like, you know, not, not that you're obligated to watch us, but I mean, some people put a lot of effort into their videos. Liz, your, your sign language video, probably, probably one of the best videos we've had in forever because you actually learned something and if something was said that mattered. Trust me, sometimes my videos are crazy uninteresting and crazy boring and crazy repetitive. There's other people on this channel that are probably ten times more entertaining than I am, so so please, just watch their videos. A couple, couple, couple more things and then I'll, I'll leave you be. Jersey Shore is cancelled. I cannot tell you how excited I am. And I know, some people are like, fuck you man, t-shirt time. I'm trying to make a video. Some people like watching the Jersey Shore. I, for one, think it's a complete waste of airtime, and really nothing is gained or lost from this TV show being thrown off the air. Secondly, there are two really good shows that are on the television that you should watch. One, Doctor Who. I just got into it, and I know I'm really coming in late in the game. Season 7 just started. I'm on Season 3, uh, which is David Tennant's Doctor, and it's uh, fantastic, and I never thought I'd join this fandom, but surely, surely I have hopped aboard. And also Workaholics, which comes on Comedy Central. I am trying to make a video. <laughs> We're doing this on purpose now. Workaholics comes on Comedy Central. I don't know when it comes on. They had three seasons so far. I watched all three in three nights. And I have to say, I was certainly pleased. I know this video was kind of long. And I hope you guys watched it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Next week's video, I'm making a questions and answers video. But I need questions from you guys. I already have a bunch saved up, but I need a lot more. So I'm leaving a link in the doobly-doo. Just type in as many questions as you want. Ask literally whatever, whether they have to do with me, opinions that I have on things, or just in general, just questions that you have for the world that no one seems to answer. Maybe I'll answer it. Or maybe I won't. Maybe I'll just make a fool of myself trying to answer it. So that's it. I'm leaving. James and special new YouTube personality on our channel. Maybe. I'll see you all tomorrow. Don't forget to be awesome. Bye.